Hello and welcome back to the colony with Man of the Ants, playing some more Empires of the Undergrowth. Continuing on with the Scoonty free play, where we have all sorts of stuff going on. Oh my word. <laughs> so we've got all of these groups, got all of these things. These guys are just gathering food over here. These guys are going for some seeds. Uh, and there's these guys over here, so we're just defending the rear of the nest entrance as well. So there are little bits of food around, but there isn't really that much. There is not huge amounts. You can see the enemies, they're only worth two, five now. Let's get uh, let's get the threes down here just to get this stuff for now. What have we got? We've got the twos and fours? Is that the ones, twos and fours? Must be. Where are the ones otherwise? Oh, I can just see the one in the background there. Yes, okay. So we probably could have used those rather than the threes, but it'll do. It'll do. We missed one. We missed one of those little bits of food, but that's okay. So the threes head back up there. So first of all, a shout out to Vince uh, Ballon. Vince Ballon. Vince Balloon. I think it's Ballon. Apologies if I got that wrong, Vince. But shout out to Vince. Just because he asked for one. Um, doesn't mean everyone gets one last one, just in case there's like a, like a thousand people ask for it. But as, as he specifically asked, there you go. Uh, the other suggestion comes from uh, Malachi. He had a fairly sensible suggestion. He said about, uh, you know, I said about it's difficult to go too far because the ants uh, they just keep coming back because they just keep coming to come back to the nest to carry the food back and it's not much. Well, Malachi had a suggestion of building lots of workers, of building a new worker nest, which we could do up here. Well, let's get that done. Um, and then just having level three workers go in to get the food collected. And everyone else on attack and then the workers on collect. Because the workers are faster, and obviously they don't cost too much if they die, and then everyone else doesn't have to run around and spread themselves thin. Which makes a vast amount of sense. A vast amount of sense. So that's exactly what we're going to do today. Now, like I said last time, I think this will probably be the last one, just because there are not a huge amount of animals around, not a huge amount of food coming off them. And the time we do this, it's going to take up a lot of our food. But we'll work on that throughout the video as we go. So let's maybe move these guys around a bit more. The ones can go there. The twos can go there. The, th the fours will leave at the sea. So there is some stuff up there and down there, actually. So maybe for now, we'll send the fours down there. So the idea is at least one of these groups, we shall turn off their food collect. And then this new group of workers that we're making, which is this chamber over here, they will be just collections. Let's turn their attack off now while we think about it. We're not going to do it quite yet, just because we need them to be leveled up a little bit more, just so they are a little bit faster. So let's do a few upgrades. I don't know if I want to do all of them or need to do all of them, but I definitely want to get a few upgraded. I'll have to do another row of those. You can see it's pretty much chewing up all our food just to get these few upgraded to level three. And they're only... Uh, we need another speed tile. Only workers, but yeah, look, our food is basically gone at this point. But that's about half of them upgraded to the level three. I think that's a pretty good start. That's a pretty good start. So if we send these guys, I mean, for now, if we just send them like over here, I suppose. And we shall leave everyone's collection on for the moment. Just while we think about where it is we're going to want and or need them. So there's a few little bits of food up here. But there's a hermit crab coming, though. Where are they? I hear this. You can see they are quite speedy, aren't they? Look at them go. Look at them go. So obviously that's only the upgraded ones that are that speedy. Well, let's move some of the fives down here, then, because there's a bit more food down there to get. Not, no enemies at the moment. So the fives, I think, will micromanage, and then the rest of them will just leave doing whatever they're doing. I think that's going to be the plan going forward. We might send a group over here, actually. Let's send the fours over here, because there's a few things appearing over there. And then we'll send the fives over here. Once they're done, let's just leave them over here for now. Group them together a little bit. I need the fours to actually go kill some things first, otherwise they're going to do nothing. Uh, one, oh, these ones have got lots of stuff down there. So where are the fives, actually? The fives can come get some seeds. 
Yeah, ones and twos and ones and twos and the food they're bringing in at this stage just isn't very much. Like, it's a large tiger beetle here. What's he worth? He's worth 10, actually. That's not bad. That's not bad. So I'm assuming that you've got the seeds. Yeah, let's come over here and get this. So our food's going up relatively quickly. Relatively quickly. Not quick. Ah, tide is coming in. So everyone come upstairs. The four is going to stay there, I suppose. So there's a little bit of food we're going to lose, but that's not too much of an issue at this stage, really, is it? Uh, fives go down. Oh, what kind of route? Oh, no, don't do that. Didn't even know you could go behind there to get to there. Uh, but in that, what the, what we can do though is we can send the ones over here and the twos over here to get this uh, whip spider. Then get him out of the way. Well, we killed quite a few. Look, to see how many that took. He's worth fifteen food. That's not bad. So the water's coming in in ten seconds. There's another one just arrived there, look. Are we going to need to send some troops there? I think we are, because there's only a few majors there at the moment. So the water's in and the water's gone. So let's start moving people up again. So I'm going to leave the fives going there for now. And then the ones, the twos, and the fours can head in this. I'm going to leave the fours over here, actually. They can deal with whatever comes from that direction. The ones and twos can deal with this area. Oh, our food has gone down, look. Has gone down. Can we do with those delicious seeds? That's what we need. These guys going to be okay? Uh... Uh, yeah, where are the fives at the moment? We should probably move them away from there because their enemy's going to come out of there and that's just going to be bad for everyone. Let's send the fives down towards these seeds. Uh, the ones can head back down here and the twos can just sort of hang around this direction for the moment. So fours, if you head up there a little bit, because there's a few things coming down. Our food's actually gone up a little bit more now, which is nice. Should we send someone down here? Should we make it the twos? Yeah, because they're not doing too much at the moment. Ha, they're not doing too much. Get it? Sorry, I'm so sorry. Take it back immediately. Food's gone down again. Something's going wrong. Something's going wrong somewhere. There's a lot of stuff kicking off here, actually. We might need to bring the fours in or someone like that to... Yeah, because I think the fours are struggling to take care of stuff on their own. And these spiders... And they're just going to rinse through the fives. Suddenly the fives are a terrible idea. The fives are a terrible idea. Come back home, fives. In fact, I might just send you back into the nest for now. Uh, yeah, just go like there. <laughs> it's, a, it's all gone horribly wrong. We've lost a fairly significant chunk of food there now, and those spiders are still causing problems. And we've got two whip spiders at the top are going to stop anyone getting by. Well, oh, this could. This might, might not last as long as I thought. This might be a bit of a challenge. Tiny little spiders coming in, causing problems as well. This one major just wandering down there for no reason. This is the armies of the ones and twos have just been decimated by, and the fours. This is everyone who's supposed to be here. <laughs> decimated by those spiders completely. Right, ones, twos, fours. Let's try. Try going on the offensive a little bit. If we can get rid of that spider, we should be okay. Yeah, he's gone. He's gone. Right, two's head down there. See if you can take care of some of those and get some of that stuff. Uh, one's head down there. Oh my word, what is going on here? Um, 
threes, let's do threes. You might close to nest attack force. Alright, fives, head back towards those seeds again. Alright, so there's a little bit more food there to come. That's not too much of an issue. Any little little larvae coming in. Hermit crab coming in there, but he's already half dead. What we haven't seen for a while is any form of uber creature come in. Back up to 600 food. Let's see if that lasts, shall we? Threes could probably do with heading back up this way. Nope. Don't do that. Threes, stay there. <laughs> wow. There's a few two starting to arrive down there. The fives are just waiting there to gather seeds, which is fine for now. The ones I might bring back here just to add as like a defense force for this middle lane. Because yeah, they're struggling a little bit to do much. Oh, here they all come. Look, there we go. That's what I want to see. Right, threes head back up there. Once you're taking care of whatever that is, something small. Yeah, a one. So a few seeds drop, they're immediately going to bring those back into the fold, which is great. Um, I've got any more, there's a lot of food just sat down here, not threes, threes, no, 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 fives, fives come down here. Oh, spider, run from the spider, he is a problem for us. Just grab the food and run, grab the food and run, they're not grabbing the food and run, are they? Hmm. I love the idea of this little collection force, but we just don't have enough people hanging around to... Uh, like twos and fives are supposed to be there. Twos and fives. Maybe we'll turn off the... Twos food gathering. I'm going to move the fives back here for now. I'm to 800, so we are, we are still getting a little bit of food, and that's not too bad. I'm okay with that. A little bit of food there. Maybe we send the ones down around there for a moment. Right, fives. Now that there's a little force of twos here, come down here, grab some of this food. I know there's not much there, but every little helps, people. Every little helps. Alright, unless you've probably got rid of a good chunk of that. We'll turn the twos gathering back on. I'm hoping they're able to get here without any problems. There's a hammer crab coming in. Hopefully they'll yeah, they'll just ignore him, which is great. So send them down here now. Turn the ones food gathering off temporarily. Don't get involved in the fight, just walk on by. Walk on by. Tiny little spider there. Is that going to be... I think we're going to be okay, actually. I think that's going to be okay. Oh, it's actually quite a big spider. I take it back. I'm to a thousand food now, so it's not going too bad, is it? So the twos have got a bit of a stranglehold there. The fours have got a stranglehold there. The ones are starting to as well. Let's turn their food gathering back on for the moment. And we'll leave the fives heading down in that direction, although that could be a problem... Yeah, you just, you just stole that food and ran past. That's great. It's exactly what I want you to do. Let's look at upgrading the rest of them where we can as well. I was going to upgrade these here, but now I immediately sort of thought, hmm, am I that flush with food I can afford to do? These are all just level one yet as well. Who are these ones? These, you're the fours. We should probably look at upgrading those at some point. The workers have done all they can. When we can, of course. So there's been a little bit of uh, discontent around the the non-even 19 tile 
and nest spaces I'm making. Uh, which I used to do quite religiously and then people had to go at me for doing it. And now I, I haven't done it for the free play just because there's so much space that you need to... Well, these aren't the most efficient nest design spaces. Um, they're good enough. Yep, <laughs> people are not happy about it. But what I said basically was when it comes to it, um, when we come back to having a, a more... Well, having less food available to us, I will definitely be a lot stricter on the food. Not the threes. Oh my word, he's right there. That's actually good. That's actually good for us. Everyone go just there and just everyone just hammer that. Hammer that. Get the food. That's all we care about right now. That's 3,000 food right there. The threes will stay defending that side of the nest. But yeah, kill him, which you've done. And then all, everyone there, your only job is to get that food. Everyone is going to send a hangar there en masse. And everything else can wait. Everything else can wait. You're just all there just to defend, basically. So in fact, we'll turn off the ones and the fours food gathering. But we'll leave the fives on. And we'll leave the twos on as well and the threes. So the ones and the fours are just there to fend things off. So I should actually move them out a little bit. And then the twos and the fives, they're there just to gather food. So there should be hopefully eight ants basically there constantly getting food off that. He couldn't have spawned in a better place. I'm so happy with that. That's going to be an amazing little boost for us. So 1800 food yeah constantly eight people on him it's perfect it is perfect look at that look at that glorious food we've got there we can look at upgrading those um well a few things now we need to upgrade some of those for starters should we do that now let's do that now oh glorious that felt so good let's do these let's do these all of these are fully upgraded all of these are upgraded where they... Oh, no, that's just the movement tiles. All of these are upgraded. Um, none of these are. Who are these? Are these the threes? Some of the threes, not the... Uh, well, there's there's the, the uh, majors, okay. So we can do the upgrading some of those as well. They're all upgraded now, pretty much. Um, 2,000. Yeah, let's do those. Let's do those. Let's do those. I'm going to go crazy with upgrades now. I would love it. That's another other creature somewhere. Oh, he's down there. If we can get him... Oh, my word. Hello. Hello. Uh, threes, I'm, I apologise, you go back there again. We might have to go and get him, but look how much it's kicking off. Let's just take a, a moment out, uh, just for a second. And we're just going to zoom out, and we're just going to appreciate this absolute carnage. Look at it. Look at what's going on here. It's absolute madness. Look at this. That's just a pile of bodies. What's, what's happening over here? What is even happening over here? It is, it is. It's just mental, isn't it? It is absolutely mental. Oh. Oh, oh I figured out the, I saw the unpausing, so we can see it in uh, wonderful close-up glory, but I'm probably going to need to come out and manage this. Oh, where are you? Come back here. Come back and manage this a little bit. Right, so I want to turn off... Basically, everyone's food gathering apart from the threes and the fives, obviously. Uh, one, two, four, five. So I want the fives just to be running around and just gathering food, whilst the ones, twos, and fours are just murdering. So I want to try and get this guy down here. So we need to go there on force. Did he just run away? Don't run away. But we have to get through all of this to get down there, and it is crazy. I'm hoping... Run away, Fires, run away. I'm assuming we got that Uber creature as well.
So no one's going to collect anything, which is going to be a bit of a negative, but I do want to get this creature. So this is the tactic for now. I might even extend the size of the thighs if I can get everything upgraded. Don't fight, just run. Don't fight, just run. That's the tactic. Right, so he's gone, pretty much. So, I want to set up some staging now. So the ones are going to stay there, the twos are going to go there, and the fours are going to go here. So basically, we're going to have little groups of defensive enemies that are going to try and protect the run of fives as they go back and forth collecting this food. In fact, no, I'm going to take that back. The fours are also going to gather food. But it's going to take them so long to actually get there. Because there's so much stuff on the way. All this stuff they've got to walk past. Probably the seeds will get them. This will get them. So I don't know how much of this guy we're going to actually manage to collect. But we'll have a go. We will have a go. Not many twos around, are there? I hope they bolster their numbers pretty quick, Shark. So how are we doing here? So there's one, two people gathering food, not many at all. We're not going to get all of it, are we? I don't think. A few more coming down now. Just ignore them, dudes. I know that when they get attacked that they, they immediately retaliate. I understand that. I'm not, you know, not, not thinking the game isn't working. I just love to see them ignoring it and running past. But that's just, you know, wishful thinking. Look at all this. Look at how crazy this is getting. Oh, this is absolutely insane. What's the difficulty? 205% difficulty we're up to. That's mad. That's mad. Our food is actually going down even though there's an uber creature up there. Which is a little frustrating. I might actually turn the ones food gathering on as well just to try and get some more food off that. It'll also get more ones running backwards and forwards and getting involved in these fights. Which right now... We really need, we really, oh my God. It's just insane. So we managed to get 300 food off it. And now look at what they got to deal with. They got to get past all this dropped food to even get down there. Oh my word. Oh, there's one. Good job, little guy. You ignore that hermit crab. Yeah, you legend, you absolute legend. The hermit crowd tried, but he was so slow. <laughs> oh, all this is kicking off over here. So the fours are still here. Maybe we'll just have to send everyone down. Just send everyone. Ooh. Oh, oh, I lost it all. I lost it all. Oh, man. Oh, that is frustrating. Oh, that is fresh. There's no auto save. I've checked this. I'm looking at the save folder now, which is why there's no music. There's no auto save for the game. So I've lost all my stuff. <laughs> I just lost all that. I don't even know how long I was recording for. Oh man, that is frustrating. That is frustrating, isn't it? Oh, it's going all right as well. I mean, not great, but it's going all right. Oh. Damn it. Darn it. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll get it set up to... I'll, I'll try and get to wherever I can, basically, because it's not going to go the same, is it? But I will get the little uh, gathering group going again, because they were working out quite well. And, uh, yeah. Oh, gutted. Gutted. Okay, so I've brought you all back in a little bit earlier than I really planned. It's only been about six minutes that I've like, carried on playing, so not much further at all. But it's diverged so drastically that I thought I just had to, really. So we've had three aphid nests. or uh, Yeah, is that a season? That's aphids. We have three aphid nests appear uh, down in this bit here where it floods. It's already flooded and it stayed there. And we had a massive fish up here as well. Literally couldn't have gone any better for us this time around. We've had no uber creatures up here yet, but yeah, a, fifth, a fish which had, I think, 1,300 food in, and these three aphid nests. So I've got the twos and the fours down here. They are not collecting food at the moment. They're just there to defend the aphids. 
and got the fives and the ones going for the fish to get to get that food as quickly as possible because that really is the priority right now i think to get that fish food all of this stuff can wait that's a thousand food that's like 10 or maybe 100 if you can include the aphids but yeah so for now we just want this and the ones We'll hopefully at some point make it around here to start helping because this whip spy is going to turn around in a second. We need some ones down here. In fact, I might even send the ones directly to him if we can get a few over here at once. I'm hoping, hoping that a bunch of these. In fact, I might even turn their food gathering off. There is a lot of food down here. Well, I say a lot. There's a lot of food items, not necessarily a lot of food. I really want the ones to come down and take care. So there's a lot of stuff arriving down here now, and those fives are going to get a bit overwhelmed, potentially. Looks like we've got a lot of one ranged units. Oh, they're just not at the wrong time. If he carried on fighting these, are these enemy ants? Well, they are. Weird. Yeah, we've not got many ones making it down at all, have we? Oh, looks like this looks like ones. Yes, I think we're okay. So if we send them to take care of him, he shouldn't be too much trouble. And then hopefully they'll go down to the fish and deal with that. We'll turn the food gathering back on now as well. Because yeah, that fish food is going to be hugely helpful. Hugely helpful. And then all this is going on down here. Really all I'm trying to do is just defend the aphid farms at the moment in the hope that they actually get quite productive. And there's a few. This one's doing okay. And there's none on this one. Lots of dead ladybirds, though, so that's something, I suppose, isn't it? So I made a slightly smaller worker nest down here to start with. Uh, only, what is it, 23 big? I've upgraded it as much as I can. I'm already up to 1,000 food. So I will up build a few more of these, I think. And then we'll look at trying to upgrade some of our other ants. Oh, now there's an uber creature Any somewhere. Creature is born equal. An extremely powerful predator, isn't He's it? normally... Re he's been the last couple of times he was fairly close to me, wasn't he? There he is. How much food is left there? 300. Not enough for us to care about. Not the fives. The fives may as well stay there for a second. But we are going to abandon the aphid nests en masse to take care of this thing. Because it's going to be really tough. I don't think we're probably up to 200% yet, are we? 194. So I'm going to turn off their food gathering for now. Just to try and get them actually focused on taking care of this guy. And then I will send, which is the biggest group, I'll send the ones down here once he's gone to try and defend this nest. And I'll turn on the fours and the fives can now go for this guy because there's only 71 food left there, so that's more important. So the fours are going to defend the fives, the threes can go and help the ones. Maybe get some of this stuff as well. Okay, this is this is going quite well. I don't know if it's going to last this long, <laughs> but for now, because these things are a problem. Just are oh, they've spawned because there's a fish? That's why they've spawned. That's interesting. So the fish is now gone. So there's not actually. Oh, so I was going to say there's no reason for the ones to go down there, but of course there is. This lovely aphid farm. So they are taking care of this. There's a thousand food come out of there now. Do we need to upgrade any of these? Yes, we do. Now is the time to do it. I have also been saving a little bit as well. I've saved like three times so far and it's been about 10 minutes. I'm a little paranoid that we're pushing this to the, to the limit somewhat. All right, so what's that? That's, that's 30. That's 30. Well, it's 29 level threes, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean. <gasps> We've almost run out of food. Oh, uh... The workers have like our food stores were almost full. That's terrifying at this stage. Right. Let's start using up some of this delicious food then. Oh, not that one, that one. And how are we doing? It's down to about 800, so it's still there. It's still there, that's the main thing. The ones and the threes are down here. The threes are gathering food, the ones aren't. Once this is gone, we can send the fives down here to try and get some of this aphid stuff but the ones a bit more central and hope that they'll fend this nest here 300 food so it's almost gone let's uh well let's do that guy and then if we well, if we upgrade that we might be able to get a couple of threes out of this do i want to get a couple of threes i probably not gonna hurt is it let's get some threes 
And then if we do that one, we can do that one, and we can do that one. Look at that. Magic. And then we've got these here to upgrade some point soon as well. So yes, this time I got rid of the wall here and I just had them directly on the, the path. Um rather than having fenced in like they were previously. So that's probably gone now. That's all gone now. Five's down here. Who else was up there? The fours. And fours come down here as well then. Yeah, fours coming down. It's an additional defense force. And put the ones in between these two bottom ones and the fours up there. So the fives have got to get past all of this chaos until they can actually get to the food. There's one. One got three. This is quite important, again, just because it's worth a bit more in terms of general pickup rather than, you know, ones and ones and ones. And it's a few 15s over there, but not all, not all that great, is it? So they're not gathering food. The twos aren't and the ones. So no one apart from the fives is gathering food down here. So let's have the fours. No, the threes. No, not the threes. Yeah. So the... Oh, they're fairly equal sized, actually. We'll have the fours gathering food as well. So the fives are doing okay there. We're almost up to 2,000 food again. I, this couldn't have gone any better this time. I'm, I'm not going to say that I'm happy it crashed because it's a massive pain in the in the, in the the arse. But it could be worse. It could be worse. Right. So we've got a fair few upgraded now, which is awesome. All the majors are level twos or threes. Getting some of these up to level three as well. The water's about to rise. Let's pull everyone back. One, two, four, five. Everyone come over here pretty much. Now, hopefully they'll all make it back, otherwise we could have a bit of a problem. I did lose a few before and it cost me about 200 food just because they got caught here because there was just a constant stream of enemies. Did I not move the three? Why are the threes down there? The threes are supposed to be back here. Oh, I made a mistake there. I wasn't supposed to pull the threes down at all. There's another uber creature. Hopefully, hopefully he's up here somewhere. On the surface, a strong creature stirs. It could be devastating to mm. be unprepared, but with great risk comes great reward. I'm very concerned he's down here somewhere and that he's about to be killed by a flood. And we're going to just immediately lose that delicious 3,000 food we should have. What's that guy doing up there? He's on a suicide mission. Has the floods gone already? Guess they must have done. Okay. Ones and twos and fives head down there. Uh, fours, your food, your food gathering is on, so you are picking that up slowly. Okay. So the ones and the twos are coming down here. They have got their food gathering off. Everyone else's food gathering's on, isn't it? Yes. Just wanted to be sure. Yeah, we must have lost that uber creature. That's that's very frustrating at this stage. Very frustrating. It's been very lucrative for us. So really, these guys are just waiting for these aphids to do something. So the fives can run up here if there's a few of them around. There's a few seeds up there. Did he get it? No, he didn't, but I, I, I did get a little close for comfort. Let's move them a bit. Move the twos up there a bit more. There's some fives getting through, or they're getting a bit lost picking up all this food, aren't they? That's what's happening with the fives. And then, again, because there's not many people coming back and forth, these guys are just hampering them completely. Mm. 
Let's move them back there for the moment. We have to do a bit of back and forth with them. So the fives have got most of that food now, which is nice. So let's send the fives down here into the slaughter zone, which is how I'm going to refer to this. I'm going to save the game. I wouldn't mind getting that food there as well, actually. Hmm. Might have to just abandon it. There's, there is a fair amount of food just around, isn't there? And that would. Ooh, ooh, let's have a cheeky go. Are there any fives around? Yeah, there are. Go on, you cheeky fives. Run away, you cheeky fives. Run away. That's a spider. You can't deal with a spider. Ah, but they can deal with a spider by the look of it. There are two spiders, actually, but yeah. That's fine. You you take care of that spider. Oh, my word. It is so hectic, isn't it? Let's move the ones up there a bit because they're about to get mullered. Oh, no, they're not. Take it back. Let's move the ones back again. Oh, my. It's just it's absolutely insane. 215% we're up to at the moment. I don't know if I've got any fives. Where are they? I think they just get stuck in the fights. There's so much. Look at look at this. Look at all of these. It's hard anyone down here defending because they've all got killed and then they can't get back up because there's so many of these. Ah, oh, the mortars. Those level three mortars. Look at it. Just, oh, crazy. But then the time they get through those, there's a bunch more there. And there's like, what, three ants down here now? <laughs> One or two ants? I think there are two mages and that's it. And that's with their food collecting turned off. We just cannot get the numbers moving because there are so many, so many enemies to take care of. I want to turn the fours food gap. Where are the fours even going? Where are the fours going? Are they still down here? They are. All right, turn your food gathering back on. I might move you guys around here as well, the fours. I think we need you. In fact, let's move you guys up here. All right, fives. If there are any fives, go for some of these lovely, delicious seeds. So we did go up with food a little bit. It's gone down again a little bit now because there's so many of these tiger beetles just coming in and really causing us some issues. And they really are everywhere. The cheeky spider just ran in as well. Oh, there's a cheeky little five. Get on five. What? I hope you're carrying something. It looks like you might be. There's a lot more food up there I'd like them to get yet. Yeah? If you're around fives, so that'd be just swell. Yeah, so really, right now, the problem isn't getting food. There's plenty of food around. The problem is collecting the food. Good, good, good. Look at them go. Look at them go. Yes, fives. Yes. Yes. Whew. I mean, this is tense. This feels tense to me. Oh, you're a... You're a good guy. You sacrificed your life for the greater good there. I mean, it's so hard to keep track of what's going on. So these guys are relatively quiet. They're just taking care of the ladybirds, really. Maybe I'll pull the twos up. Do I need to? I don't know if I need to. There's a lot of ants coming in. No, I don't really need to, do I? Take it back. So a lot of fives running around, get them some of this food, which is nice. Not so nice the fact that there's spiders come in. All this whip spider who's about to back his way up to us. Uh, so threes, let's bring you down here for a moment. Just to clear this area out.
I would love to have more fives. Uh, Malachi, who suggested this tactic in the first place, and again, a big thanks to Malachi for that. It's worked out very nicely. Uh, suggested having 60 of them, which is a fantastic idea, but I'd really love to just get everything upgraded as I possibly can. There isn't that much more to do saying that. But before we even consider making any more, and you can see how this is just eking away at our food, look. Although saying that, saying that, That might be all of them upgraded that we can. I think it is, yeah, I think it is. In which case, we'll look at making another row in a second. We've got a little bit more food. Guys, <laughs> every time I go outside, it's just chaos. Absolute chaos. Uh, I'm gonna send the fours uh, down in this direction as well. Um, Cause they'll collect the food and they'll go back and forth and they'll make this sort of defensive line that we have. Cause, oh my word, what is going on? More aphids there. Is it worth going for these aphids instead? It might be. It might be. If I put the fours like here to defend against this, I know there's a lot of food down there, but the, that this shortened distance could help out a lot. A lot, a lot. Uh, the threes could probably do with moving back towards their original territory. Look at that. Look how many ladybirds they killed. That's insane. So the fours are food gathering, the fives are food gathering, the ones and the twos aren't. But do we need all of them there in such a shorter distance? It's an interesting question. We'll see how it goes for the moment with the fours and the fives collecting. I'm going to have to put the fours up there. Ah, good timing. Actually, look at that. The water's coming. If we move the twos back a little bit, the one smack bang in the middle, the fours up there, and the fives will aim up there, but they need to run through a lot to get there, so they'll probably collect food on, on the way most of the time. And now there's an uber creature, but again, just as the tide's coming in. So I suspect, again, we might be in a very unfortunate situation. An extremely powerful predator is nearby. Yes, he might also be in the worst location possible. It's hard to tell with the fog of war, isn't it? Hmm. So our food's going up a little bit, just a little bit. Not huge amounts, but enough. I'll take it. Should we move the one? No, we need people to get rid of these, the ladybirds. We can't move them too far away, can we? Like, yeah, who else was the twos go for that? Okay, that's not too bad, actually. Let's do that. So, goodbye, Uber creature. I'm sure you were great while you lasted. But those aphid nests are still down there if we want them. And those seeds are still there as well. But I'd like to try and protect these for the moment if we can. Could be a nice, just a nice little source of food for us in some very lean times. Not seeing many fives around. What, what happened into the fives? Where are they getting so stuck? I suppose there's a few. There's a few. There's some food down here, fives. Okay, head back up there then. We could head up there as well, actually. If you're nearby. Look at this. What about there then, five? <laughs> right, let's look at building another row of these guys. At some point I do need to make some more actual soldier ants as well, but... Whew. Who's got the time for that, right? Yeah, that's going to get us that to level 3 there as well, look. Wonderful. Wonderful. 
Where are my fives at? There's a couple. Getting involved in fights by the look of it. Do I send the fours down there as well? Or should I send the fives? Where else am I going to send them? It's chaos everywhere. Let's maybe send the ones around the corner for now and see if we can get them there to defend this and get the fives collecting this little bit of food that is there. watching these ladybirds and seeing if any of them are actually getting away with so the ladybirds now when they die I'm sure I've seen oh there's one that's died it's okay it did drop one food still I was getting very suspicious so the fives are slowly working their way through they've got another 700 food let's make another make one one of these long rows and maybe we'll leave that and start working on that's what that put us up to like 40 odd then won't it Now, I was convinced this was going to be the last video on this particular map because I just didn't see how we would survive past where we were. But in some very trying times, we've done all right. And up to 226% difficulty. And I think I'm going to have to leave that there. I don't actually know how long this video is going to be because it's been all over the place. Uh, I might send, yeah, let's send the fours down there for the second. Because they're just sort of hanging there, aren't they? And then the ones and the fives will pull. No, not the threes. Not the threes. And yeah, I'll probably have to leave that there. Because like I say, I've just got, I've got no idea. I've been recording for a little over an hour. I suspect the video, well, I suppose I actually didn't cut that much out, did I? Because it's like five minutes until I started again, because it got so, so divergent from where we were that I felt the need to, uh, oh, need to move the fives. <laughs> felt the need to, to immediately bring you guys back in a lot earlier than anticipated. All right then, yeah, I'm gonna, oh my word, look at that delicious food. Get down there, fives. Fives and threes? Look at them, it's, it's wonderful having this force of uh, collector ants, actually. I don't know why I didn't think of it. I'm not bringing in much, so it's only like, you know, maybe 30 food there, but whew, it does, does the job. Right, yeah, I mean, I could just carry on with this forever. It feels like, but I'm going to leave that there then. So, 226% difficulty we're up to. Oh, things are getting crazy. Things are getting proper crazy. Cool. Well, as always, I hope you're enjoying this ongoing Scoonty free play. It's been mental. Absolutely mental. If you've enjoyed it, of course, do click the like button. That's massively appreciated. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Questions, comments, leave them down below. I am behind on comments further than I usually am, which is because I do... I don't tell anyone I work with, but I do tend to use some of my time in work to answer a few comments because my evenings are either spent with the wife or recording videos and the such like. And I've been training for the last few days, so I haven't had a chance to get around to comments at all, I'm afraid. So I don't think I've done the last Empire's video yet, so apologies for that. I will get around to it as soon as I possibly can. So do leave your comments. I do very much appreciate them. Don't forget, I do stream on Wednesdays, and it'd be lovely to see you there. Say hello. It just fills me with joy. Otherwise, I will see you next time in Empires of the Undergrowth to carry on this insane free play. Someone did say in one of the previous ones that they carried it on about as far as they could go. Um, but I can't remember if they said what difficulty they got to, so I don't know. I don't know whether that's high. I mean, you can see my frames per second there are really starting to tank. I might have to turn the settings down a little bit because uh, I haven't checked. In fact, let's just very quickly bring this up. Oh no, because sometimes when the frame rate really starts to suffer, it does affect the recording as well. But no, we've had no recording issues today, which is good because I was paying no attention to those numbers. <laughs> so let's chuck a save in there. And that's exactly where I leave it. As always. Thank you very much for joining me.